I realized that I was seeing all of these companies who were already coming out of the social media era trying to figure out, you know, the whole business of the attention economy is predicting people's desires, getting out in front of them wherever you can, and, and you know, sh and even shaping people's desires if at all possible. And so coming out of Hacking Your Mind, I was like, wow, we are really shapeable. And there's all of this nascent, at the time, you know, but this was pre-transformer models. I was looking at like neural networks and machine learning, these sort of primitive AI models. And then suddenly transformer models hit, which, which are what gave rise to ChatGPT and the rest. And they suddenly made it possible for them to, you know, for people to read huge amounts of human behavior data and get insight out of it. And I just thought, oh no, there's something terrible coming. And I need to, you know, I'm not typically the kind of person who, who, who thinks like, you know, I have to tell the world a thing or they won't know. But this was a thing where I just didn't see anybody. Say, you know, I saw lots of books about super intelligence and the threat, the Terminator threat of AI and that kind of thing. And I wasn't worried about that. And I still remain pretty unconvinced that that's what's coming. 